Hi, Kathy Murakami here to give you a couple of ideas to help you stretch your hips. So the thing about the hips is that they get tight if you're athletic or you exercise a lot, you want to work on your butt, and they get tight if you just sit on your butt and do nothing. So really stretching and keeping your hip area open is going to save your low back in the long run. So here's a couple of ideas. If you're able to sit on the floor, you happen to be sitting on the floor, you can just cross your legs like this, the ankle bone on the outside of the thigh, right above the knee, flex the foot, this is very important, and then you can just slightly lean forward. And then as you lean forward, we're not rounding in the back something like this. You actually want to feel your weight shift in front of your sit bones. So something like that where you're folding here at the groin. You can also do this bringing the knee up, the opposite knee up, leaning back, working to keep your spine pretty straight so we're not collapsing. And again, the knee slightly opens, the foot stays flexed, you do not want the foot rolling like this. Really be sure that pinky toe pulls back and you'll feel that nice stretching sensation right here. Another option is for you to lie all the way down, cross the leg over, and then reach for the opposite inner thigh and pull back. You can use your elbow to keep the knee open. You just want to avoid pulling your tailbone off of the floor. If you feel your upper body in something like this, I'm exaggerating, but your shoulders are off and your chin is up, you are going to be much more comfortable if you have a pillow or two underneath you to bring the floor to the back of your head. Make sure you're breathing out. Again, keep that foot flexed. And if you can stay here and hold this for about 30, 40, 60 seconds, you'll gain a lot more benefit. If you happen to be standing, let's say you went on a hike or a walk somewhere, another nice way to stretch your hips is to cross the same way, flexing the ankle. Hang on to something stable, either a bench or a fence. You're going to stick your rear end out, keep your spine neutral and long, and just sit back, okay? Again, avoid rounding and hunching your back, and just sit down only as far as you can keep that back straight. Feel your sit bones reaching away from you. This is very uh, key in your technique. Hang out, stretch that little side hip, and then you shake your leg out to the other side.